this is our job to manage through uncertainty and uh, you have to accept the market as it is and accept reality and not fight reality. I think there's still a significant amount of uncertainty, but as we get into 2023 and we start to have a clear understanding of the trajectory of capital markets, I think you'll see issuers and capital allocators meet again in the middle, although at different valuations. Out over the next nine months, you can see projected returns actually looking quite attractive, not surprising given the base we're at currently. When you have a focus on sustainability, there are incredible opportunities to invest today investing in renewables. It's just an incredible time actually to have great financial returns and to do the right thing. There's a big role for CBDC and blockchain to actually affect real-time movements of money cross-border, low cost, immediate transfer of funds, and I see blockchain as a great piece of technology to satisfy that requirement. Stable coins have a real potential to drive efficiencies and disruption across payments and capital markets activities. Hong Kong remains the only place in the world where the global advantage and the China advantage come together in a single city.